It doesn't get any more tension-packed than this. The 2022 FIFA World Cup Final. Who is going to come out on top? All the action is next, live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup Final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Argentina versus France. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Rodrigo de Paul starts alongside Leandro Paredes in central midfield. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Presnel Kimpembe plays alongside Rafael Varane in central defence. Paul Pogba plays with N'Golo Conte in the centre of the park. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts with Karim Benzema. And now they get the ball rolling. So this is it for Argentina. World Cup winners in 1978 and 1986. Runners-up in 1930, 1990 and eight years ago in 2014. Are they going to do it here in 2022? What a big night for them. Well, it's a massive night. And when you talk about World Cup finals, I always go back to 1978 as a great occasion. Ticker tape in Buenos Aires. The kickoff delayed because one of the Netherlands players had a cast on his arm. Mario Kempes, brilliant player. Ozzy Ardiles, that was Argentina at their best. Can they reproduce that sort of form here today? I oh, think they on, can. Oh, hang on, Stuart. Big chance here. And it's in. We've just witnessed the first goal of this 2022 World Cup final. One to Sabre. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And Benzema wasn't going to miss this one. From that sort of range, he was always going to score. That's a well-constructed goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Messi, and Messi, a smart stop here. Delivering it. Oh, the equaliser, just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive.
Well, let's look at this again. It's a decent delivery into the box. And then what a strike. The lovely half volley. It's so difficult to keep these down. This is a very tidy finish. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Messi. That is how to put in a challenge. He's been a bit unlucky to concede the corner. Fired over by Messi. And a struggle to get it away properly. Now can they counter clinically? Mbappe. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Giovanni Lo Celso. Messi. Messi. Nicely timed tackle. Benzema. This is Coma. He's going forward well here. Mbappe! Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. Martinez. He's in with a chance. Keeper, impressive. Mbappe. Griezmann. Griezmann. Griezmann! And a goal to put them in front. Real drama here. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and what a strike from Griezmann. He just smashes it past the keeper. That's a top-class finish. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Well, since they have the ball, a referee playing advantage here. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. And he's fired over the corner. Danger averted. The corner kicks keep on coming. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Well, no luck keeping possession. In control, Griezmann as he goes forward. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Plenty of options. Gives it a go! Misfiring completely. Yeah, he's gone for power, but the contact was never right. It's a poor effort, really. Molina. He might be able to profit from the wide position. It's looking promising. And a touch off the defender last of all, so a corner. Can someone get on the end of this? What an important piece of defending. And a tidy challenge. He's in behind. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. So the corner played into the box. Still not clear. Well, nothing untoward happened. 
This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Can they keep it going? It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Romero. Otamendi has it. Marcos Acuna. Di Maria. Well, the supporters think it's on. And he struck the post. Well, they can keep possession now. Well, they're so unlucky not to be level now. It was a great effort. You just wonder if they're going to regret that. Yes, a really up and flow to the game. End-to-end -end stuff. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? All hands on deck. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed. And the dream remains very much alive. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. So, underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. Martinez. Can they forge ahead? defending but brilliant defending fantastic work to thwart the danger Mbappe well the counter chance looks very real well disappointing end to the move well this is a really good game of the football both sides have played well going forward there's been plenty of chances oh wait a minute Stuart opportunity that's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. A chance to nudge in front. Corner kick here. And the problem not completely solved. They could nudge in front. And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations! Well, here it is again, and the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area, just poor defending all round. So France get the ball rolling once more. We're about to find out how they're going to react to the setback. Mbappe. They need to get tighter. Oh, what an opportunity! It's still alive! Not a great challenge. Free kick here. Well, no card, but the referee clearly indicating that he's on his last warning. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. So the ball is rolling again. France trailing after the first half. Can they find an effective response here in the second? Really bright-looking attack. And his teammate got him out of trouble. Karim Benzema. Can they square the game? And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. An interceptor there. Oh, good save. Now sending it in. Well, not quite the corner he had in mind. Goalkeeper has it. Di Maria and they've given him too much space well, a bit short with the clearance excellent defending 
N'Goro Conte. This is Coman. Moving into the advanced position. And he couldn't worry the keeper with that effort. Martinez. Oh, he's through here. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, here it is again. And it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Lionel Messi. Mbappe with it. Might be a chance here. And oh, it's in. We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Goal! Well, France just a goal behind now. And you never know, you sense the momentum may be with them. Coman, Griezmann, Karim Benzema, thirty minutes to go then, and the counter looks on here. Options available. Griezmann, Pogba, now Conte. Cross didn't beat the first man. So France behind, but what can they do with this corner? Taken short. And there's the feed into the box. Threat over for now, it seems. Chances on. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And what a clinical finish this is from Lataro. He hits it with such power. That's a good goal. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. And he has options available. Hernandez. Now Paul Pogba, and Pogba! Oh, a nearly moment, but not quite good enough. Well, you certainly can't fault them for effort. They keep applying the pressure, and if they can just nick one, they're right back in this. Well, can they be creative from here? And the attack showed promise, but easy work for the keeper in the end. Kylian Mbappe. Good move in the making from France. And a chance to whip it in here. Well, he made great contact with that one, but the goalkeeper had his own ideas. And well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Well, he's lost it. Mbappe and the block by Otamendi good tackle it'll be a throw and they're making a change Martinez 
Well, the pass not finding its target. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Who can he pick out? Firing is in. And fine goalkeeping. Giroud. Can he find the net? And saved by the keeper. Now the delivery. Oh, and couldn't convert. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Marcos Acuna. De Paul. Martinez. Lionel Messi. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Oh, this is looking promising. And it was a good counter-attack in the making, but very alert defending. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Benzema. Well, not quite the header he had in mind. And the goalkeeper gobbling that one up. De Paul. The ball with Martinez. France doing well to regain possession. Pogba. And Giroud with that effort. And the keeper did more than enough. And over it comes. Not out of the woods yet. Well, I don't think that effort remotely qualifies as respectable. And the reason it's off target, because the technique was really poor on that occasion. That's not a good effort. And very deftly cut out. Lionel Messi. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Now Paul Pogba. Just made sure nothing came of that. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Could pull one back here. Oh, that's a fine save. Who can they pick out? And there goes the final whistle. For the third time in history, Argentina have won the World Cup. And I have to say, Derek, they've been the best team in the tournament. There's no doubt about that. Argentina, world champions! They did it in 1978 and 1986. They've done it again in 2022, Stuart. Well, this is the pinnacle of any footballer's career and what a night it's been for these players and the coaching staff and, of course, the fans.
just witnessed the first goal of this 2022 World Cup final. Delivering it. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. Griezmann. Griezmann. Griezmann! And a goal to put them in front. Real drama here. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. And the problem not completely solved. And this time it's in! Fabulous goal, and just look at the celebrations. Martinez. Oh, he's through here. A two-goal cushion now, and just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way. Mbappe with it. And oh, it's in. We cannot declare this contest over. The... Chances on. And there is the goal to make it a hat-trick. Excellence in finishing there for...